Today we're covering three things around COVID that I found on Kickstarter, starting with, hey, Corona, you know, funded in 44 minutes and 100 backers, according to their post, which I feel is a bit fishy, you know, I couldn't find how much they originally wanted for the product, so I presume it's flexible funding of sorts. But yeah, there's now apparently over 660 funders uh, with a total of over 21,000 raised. You know, some quick math, that's roughly $32 per person for a fucking card game. You're telling me on average people spent $32 on this. This. Generally, people are stingy, right? Especially when it comes to card games. I remember back in the day when Yu-Gi-Oh cards raised their price slightly for a pack of cards or a deck and people lost their fucking mind. And that was like a staple card game. But people are willing to pay that much for a game about a deadly disease. But as for this project, that's not even the worst part I found. What is, you know, there's been people posting recently about when they will receive it, if it's a scam, you know, have they actually gone through with it? Not only is it terrible, but it's also potentially a scam perhaps, which, you know, it's all super scummy. Yeah, the next one, it's, uh, it, it's a fucking box with some plastic pieces in it that they could have made about anything else. I mean, this is the thing, right? You know, it's got my heart beating after looking at it again, because that's just it. They could have made it on anything else. You know, magical creatures, animals, ethos. It doesn't fucking matter. They could have made it on whatever. But they settled for, hey, you know, there's something plaguing the world. Let's make it about that, because funny? No, it can't be that. You know, is it an interest in perspective? No, definitely not that. Either. You know, maybe they're raising funds for COVID related things. No, 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 no. Of course fucking not. Because they don't give two fucks. If you want to do something related to the pandemic and maybe dosh out a little, then you can go to charities like the Crisis Foundation and Age UK, both of which do amazing work. Look, I know I went off in a bit of a tangent. Uh, I know I was going to talk about three things that were COVID related, but, you know, it's just a disgrace when people try and do make money from such tragic things. And it's for such a greedy cause as well. But I'm an individual of my word. Three things I promise and three things I will deliver. So my final thing is this. It's just another thing that came up when I was searching for COVID. It's just someone writing names on grains of rice. Not much else to it. I don't really understand it. Listen, it's very late at the moment. I couldn't find something better. Just let this one slide. But anyway, I hope you're having a nice time wherever you are in the world. Uh, I'm Liam. Have a lovely day.